And pulls that one away nicely. Beautifully played. That's part of the reason that you don't bowl short on this pitch. No good there on the leg side. Especially the Greg Blewett attacking field. That's just going to trickle into the fence. Well, he changed up pretty good there and just whacked it for four. Greg Blewett just thrives on anything short. That's a bit of an ugly sign, too, for the bowler. This time, Blewett gets away through the gully region. Didn't quite time it right, but it's going to be at least three. They'll probably think about the fourth. And they're going to get it. Well, it did disappear like that. Anything short, and that's his 50. What a magnificent knock by Greg Blewett. Based on the 51 here. And South Australia going on to no wicket for 93. Yeah. Stuart Clark here just... Oh, there's a dive, and unfortunately, Davison, with the, with the weather here, They've had lots of rain, and I think he has hurt himself here. Well, I don't think Guy will be diving for that one. That's gone straight in, and that's a, just a great start for uh, Greg Blord here. Goes on to 60. Yeah. Well, he's not learning at all. What a magnificent shot there from Greg Blord. And it's gone all the way there with the slide going into the fence. Different ways to skin a cat. Goes up and up and over. All the way down to the barrier. Magnificent shot there from Greg Blewett. Likes to use his feet. Didn't try to hit it too hard at all, did he? Again, not afraid to loft the ball either. Flush outfield here. May just make it, may not. We'll have to wait and see. No, it doesn't. And they're going through for the extra run. Lovely shot again. Straight down the ground. Not a great deal of turn there for Friedman. Just one bounce. And into the fence. Lovely shot. And another short one. And that's going to be four runs. Similar start to this over as to his previous one. Oh, that's a good drive there. Getting through. Oh, and he just missed a lovely four there. And that's his hundred. Magnificent 100 here for Greg Blewett. What a great start to the season for this captain. His 11th Shepherd Shield 100. His 20th First Class 100. Great applause from his teammates. 186 balls for his 100. And he's well on the way of making a real big one here if he wants. And what a shot is that. Just stand and deliver. One of the hardest shots to play. It wasn't a bad ball either from Shane Lee, but he just got on the front foot and jumped all over it. That's beautiful weight transfer there. We'll get a great shot of it here. This is uh, the perfect way to play a cover drive. Get your weight over the ball. You don't have to swing that hard with the bat if you get a good piece of it as he did then. Well, another 35 overs to be bowled today. Well, they should get there pretty easily, I would have thought. Especially with what's to come, they've got young Nathan Adcock, who's a fine player, uh, Ben Johnson, Tim Nielsen, Bradley Young. Hit that, and he certainly did, down the ground. And that's going to go all the way. What a great start for Blewett. Takes him on to 131. I heard he's been working, Greg Blewett's also been working on some off-spin this year. Is that, is, that, is that correct, Joe? Actually started the end of last year. He fancies himself, especially in the one-day games, to get a few out, so... Uh, We'll have to wait and, and see how he goes. A beautiful <laughs> shot through the covers there. From how good a shot's that? That 
outside off stuff, a little bit full from Bevan, and he just threw the kitchen sink at it. Stand and deliver. Wonderful shot. Takes him on to 140. Oh, when he gets on that right knee, I'll tell you, there's not a better side here in Adelaide. There's been a little bit of wayward bowling out there, but from New South Wales that have helped things along for the batsmen. Don't have to worry about too much stress or, or being tied down too often by too many maiden overs. There he goes down the track again. Good use of the feet, this time over mid-off. It's a long chase. The man from mid-on's coming around. He won't get it. It's another good ball. Weather, eh? Oh, it's, it's hit the stump and it's bowling. Can you believe that? It's hit his leg, ricocheted onto his hands, and then just bounced softly onto the leg stump, and he's out bowled for a magnificent 175. Yes, a fine hand by Greg Bull. A little unlucky in the finish. It's come from the bottom of the bat onto his leg by the look of it. And uh, it's just trickled onto the leg bale and, and disturbed it. But he would be disappointed, even though he's batted beautifully today and made a fine 175. He, he would have thought that he could have made 200. And uh, we'll have a look at the reverse angle replay of the dismissal. It was going well down leg side. He got himself in good position. It's at the bottom of his gloves. And then it's taken a bit of a leg break onto the bale. And uh, that is stiff. But Bluey, I think, after he's got off and had a shower and probably had a bit of a think about it, he will remember the fact that he was dropped at uh, 13 and uh, cricket's that type of game. But a fantastic achievement from him. 175 is a beautiful innings. And as a captain of the side, he's set the game up for the Redbacks. And also, uh, from a point of view of a player trying to get his place back in the Australian side, he started off the side.